Happy Halloween, everybody. This is Ron Moore, and this is Ghost House for the Second Master System. Yeah, never heard this game until recently, and since it's Halloween, this is the perfect time to go ahead and do a video on this, a first impression review. Let's see how this game is. All right, so, well, my character has, okay, this is the demo screen right here. Actually, I'm not playing yet. Big freaking ears. Jeez, I don't know who you're playing as. Uh, don't really know the story of this game. Is it like a Boo Haunted House? I don't know. I've never played that game, actually. What well, was that, a blue Slimer that the character just killed? Huh. Alright, so almost a bit like a Master System version of Ghosts and Goblins here. Alright, here we go. Now I'm playing. Oh, is that Meatwad down there? Jeez. Alright. Uh, okay, I guess that... Yeah, I just got some energy with that. Alright, so... Okay, I got a key. Whoa, look out. Oh, oh I just got shot right in the butt. Alright, down here now. Reminds me a bit of the Goonies here. Oh, jeez, I can't get shot in the head, man. It looks like I just fell flat in my face there. I just actually... Okay, Dana, I fell through the ground. Man, what is this Simon's Quest stuff? Look at this, man. Jeez, come on. Uh, whoa. Whoa! Okay, a big black bat now. Coming after me. Jeez, I'm getting pwned by that thing. Man, how do I... Jeez, man, all these these arrows and this black bat that keeps coming after me. I, the music has changed. Whoa! I guess this is the boss. Was that Dracula or some sort of vampire? Okay, he's... Oh, no, I thought he was gone. There he is again. Man, this guy... Oh. Hit him! Is it... There's gotta be... Uh, there's gotta be some weapons in this game I can use besides my fist. Man, he's putting his hands on me. Jeez. He just busted me in the mouth. Okay, now he's gone again. That's freaking weird. Alright, got some energy there. Was that the boss of the stage that was poning me? I mean, jeez, how do you... Oh, oh, damn. Blue Slimer, watch out. Oh, I got pwned by Meatwad. He just flamed me. All right, here we go again. Jeez, man, I guess you can't hit him. What the heck? Totally got killed right there. Come on, Spock, with your big ears. Jeez. Man, really? This is... Ah, oh, this game is so cheap. Soundtrack is okay so far. See, look at that. That's Simon's Quest BS. Come on, man. Ah, I, th I thought I jumped over it. I forget I'm going down here. I keep shooting those arrows. Whoa, huh. barely made it on that. What? Here we go again. I think it's the the part of the floor that has a long brick is where you fall through it. That's stupid. Yeah, even Simon's Quest, that was just stupid. All right, got some more energy here. I'm trying to pick up... I guess you can't pick up everything, of course, but... Looks like you pick up those items there, and I guess you cannot. Ah, uh, freaking Meatwad again. Ah, oh, jeez. Man, he just roasted me. Well, game over already. Uh, I doubt I'm going to get past the first level. Let me try this again.
Man, they keep getting shot by those freaking arrows. Who's shooting those arrows? That freaking meat wad again. <laughs> it looks like I keep falling down on my face. I am falling on my face in this game. Getting pwned. Oh. Oh, shoot. I open the coffin. Well, how did I do that? I guess you just walk by and it comes open. Or maybe that key that, that I have it automatically opens it when you walk by there. And I guess to make him disappear, you got to go into another part of the room, another part of the level. Oh, look at that. That's cheap. I'm trying to duck. And then at the same time, ghosts come over. and Man, this game's so cheap. Oh, man. Jeez, all right. Uh, whoa, don't go in a fire pit. Dang, I can't jump that high, so... Oh, oh no, I don't want to... Oh, good. I, can't, I, I missed the lock of the coffin, so therefore... The uh, Dracula would not be able to come out and get me. I mean, it, there's got to be some power-ups in this game. Oh, almost up in his coffin there. Oh, jeez. Oops. Here we go. Man. Ah. Yep. Try this again. I think this is my last life before I get game over again. Ah, here we go again. Simon's quest. Is there any holy water in this game where you can find where the false floors are? Uh, don't wake up Dracula. Oh, good. Shot right in the head. My hair should freaking block it. Got freaking Elvis or Honky Tonk Man here. Kind of like a, a chibi version of Castlevania for Sega Master System. Oh, that's so cheap. Come on, let me get up the ladder. Freaking reject a uh, boy in his blob. What the? What? You can get stuck in the spider webs? Come on, man. I'm not an insect. Dang it, I forgot. Ah, oh. Man. There's got to be a weapon upgrade, but where do I get it? Oh man, let me escape. Dang, Round is about to escape. He gets me. Oh, go back down here again because he's gone. Just like Metal Gear Solid. On easy, evade a room, and then the soldiers will stop chasing you. He's got full energy again. Probably not for long. Alright, don't wake up Dracula right now. Because i got to figure out how I'm going to beat him first. That is Dracula. I don't know. I don't know who the boss of this game is. If it is Dracula or what. With an ugly orange tomato thing from Uninvited. 
freaking meat water. Go back, or whatever the enemy is. Go back to Doom. And I'm doomed right here. I'm not going to be able to get past the first level. At least this is not as bad as my hero. At least this game's not one-hit kills. I don't know if this game is really a hit so far. It's just frustrating BS. Alright, I guess I'm going in circles here. Like, Yeah, I'm going in circles in this level. What am I supposed to do? I think I'm supposed to be Dracula or the bat. Whatever, I'm calling Dracula. Heck with it. And then I guess that's how I can proceed to the next round. I don't get it. Oh, freaking meat water. Leave me alone. Oh, here we go again. Awoken Dracula. Can I even hit him? Look at that. Man, that's so cheap. Man. What the heck? He disappeared in human form or vampire form, whatever, for a second. There he is again. Ah. Freaking Eddie Munster over here. They keep attacking me? Jeez. All right, let's try this again. I think this is going to be my last time. Whoa, what the? What the heck did I do? Okay, I seen that happen in the demo screen, but I don't know how he did it. What did I do right there? Whoa, what? Oh, I hit that light. I jumped into that light, and I guess it temporarily freezes everything. That's pretty cool, I guess, because light drives away the darkness, see? Huh. That's pretty cool. Oh, I still got shot by the arrow. Oh, did I just jump on that one? Did the, ugh, stop that. I keep falling for it. All right, let me freeze everything here. Give me a break from everybody chasing me. Bats and blue slimer and meat wad and the arrows. Freaking Dracula. I want to feel freeze Dracula. Whoa. Whoa, wait a minute. I got a sword this time. How did I get that? Oh, so, wait a minute. I jumped on top of that sword thing. Ah, oh, what the, now I lost it. What the, what was that all about? I guess you got limited use, and that's stupid. I don't know how I got in the first place. I think I accidentally jumped on one of the arrows shooting at me. That's how you obtain it? That's a weird way to do it. All right, everybody freeze for a second. Jeez, everybody shut up. Man, I, ah, I keep forgetting. Keep forgetting to... Ah, oh, man. Jeez. There we go. Finally jumped over that gap. That false gap. All right, nice. <laughs> that was for nothing. I didn't even get to duck it. Here we go. Of course, I don't have my sword anymore. Jeez. Oh, I got one now. Now what's up? Oh, if I can hit him. Jeez. If I can hit him, come on. Oh, oh, I got him right there. Does that count as a hit? Did I even hit it? Is he invincible? 
Oh, I know I got him right there. Ah, oh, now I lost it again. See, that's freaking lame. That's so stupid. What kind of a sorry game has it to where you have a limited sword ability? Come on, man. All right, I got it back. Come on, get him. Keep stabbing. Oh. Oh, I got him. Nice. Nice. Finally got him. Get the heart. Oh, full energy again. Oh, wait. What the heck? So I'm still in this level. So what was that? The mini boss then? What the heck just happened? Did I just beat the mini boss? Then who's the boss in this level? Uh, it's a good thing I uh, fell through the platform there. Nice. Well, how did I get the knives or swords? Whatever the heck I was using. Man. I, I just do not know. I mean, like I said, obviously this is a first impression review, so didn't do really any research or read the instruction book or anything how to play, so... Just a uh, blind run here. And I will be looking on YouTube to see how the heck you play this game. Well, that's what you get. You should have the instruction book. Uh -huh. Ah, man. How do you beat that thing? Whoa. What did I do? You just jump on top of it? You just jump on top of it. Oh man, uh, this is starting to remind me of uh, this could be uh, Action 52 for Sega Master System. I think I said it before in another game. I did. Was it My Hero? I don't know. But anyway, like I said, this game is better so far than My Hero. Oh no. Really, what is that thing? A big red fire blob. Yes, I, I just gave up right there, as you can tell. Yeah, I'm done. I'm done. I got about as far as I'm going to get in this. Um, anyway, Ghost House for the Sega Master System. As you can see right there, you, I guess, use the Master System card, not the actual cartridge. I never played this when I was a kid, so I don't know. I never had a game back then when I was a kid for the Master System that required me to use the card. I never had those games. I only had the cartridge-based games. But anyway, yeah, my first impression of this, i say a 4, maybe a 5 out of 10. Maybe if I actually figure out how to play it right, I like it better. Because, again, this is a first impression review, a blind run. Um, it did seem interesting when I first seen the cover box to this game. And I thought I'd try it out. And uh, but uh, as far as trick or treat is concerned, uh, this is not exactly a treat for me. More like a trick. So I uh, hope you guys have a fun and safe Halloween. And um, hopefully you get some better treats than this game. Then again, this could be a game, a, a good game. Like I said, I'm probably need to give it more of a chance and actually learn how to play it. But not a good first impression so far. However. I may give it more of a chance in the future. And I'm definitely going to look on YouTube to see if the game is really that good and how to, how to actually play it. All right, guys, that is it. I am out of here. I'm Ron Moore. God bless and take care.